Dear Brock Lesnar, I didn't start watching WWE on a regular basis until 2003. Back then, watching SmackDown almost every Thursday, I remember watching you being called the next big thing. I'll never forget when you and Big Show broke the ring. Brock Lesnar to the top row! Top row! A 500 pound super superplex! Oh my god! Holy I'll also never forget when you gave an F5 to a shark. Now, I was a fan of your abilities back in the Ruthless Aggression era, and I didn't miss you when you left for eight years. When you came back in 2012, I'll admit, I started getting annoyed at your part-time schedule. But looking at it today, I come to realize that the current run that you're on now has lasted longer than your original run. You stayed gone for eight years, but you came back ten years ago. Needless to say, your career from 01 to 04 pales in comparison to what's been going on from 2012 to 2022. You're a 10-time WWE Champion, and only three of those reigns were back in the Ruthless Aggression era. Not to mention the fact that you were the one to conquer the Undertaker's WrestleMania streak. I'm still mad at that, by the way, but whatever. I think it's safe to say that you are the big thing now. It felt kind of weird seeing you work without Heyman, but honestly, I've been digging the work you've been putting in as of late. Now look at you. Title for title in the main event of a third WrestleMania with Roman Reigns. Austin and Rock battled at three different manias. So did Hunter and Taker. Now, it's you and Roman. I don't know how much longer I'm going to be blessed to see you in the WWE ring, but I'm going to enjoy what's left at that time regardless. Good luck at WrestleMania, because I shall acknowledge you as the tribal beast. Sincerely, James.